being short with you. I always thought you were rather tall and a belligerently blonde sort of way. Give me a break. Just take it easy. If we hear any news about Jesse, we'll call you up there, okay? You know he's probably dug in someplace to ride out the weather. Very likely. But I just can't shake this feeling. I guess not the kind of man you have to worry about. But I know there's something wrong. Are you sure that's all? Maybe it's the noise and people down here. Funny. You know, I never thought of it as noisy. You wouldn't do very well in New York. I guess not. Did you ever get through to Dad? You're not having a very good time here, are you? No, not really. It's not your fault. I want to spend time with you. I want to know you better. I'm not good at saying this personal stuff. Well, you're doing a great job. I'm just worried about Dad right now for some reason. Yeah, I know. You know, I was dreaming about him all night. <laughs> Tiger, I read you five by five, Flash. Hold on. I've got you a call through to you. Jesse? Hi, Mom. He's not back yet. There's something wrong, isn't there? There's no sign of him. Matt, Cody and I think there's something wrong with Jesse. I think you can feel it, too. I can hear it in your voice. Maybe we're all having a major attack of drama. With too much imagination. If he's okay, we're all gonna look pretty silly. Well, we'll chance it. Cody and I are gonna come back. Can you pick us up? Come to the ranger station. I'll pick you up there. Matt? Any idea where he might have gone? There's a dozen places he likes. Could be anywhere. Hey, 
say, Mr. Bodie, is it? That's some memory you got there. I figured you'd remember. Something I can do for you? Yeah. Those, uh, those two officers that were up here yesterday, I think they're who I need to talk to. You know where I might find them? You look kind of beat up, Mr. Bodie. Well, I've been driving all night. I turned around just outside Sacramento. Strikes me you're a man with a problem. Something happened up there yesterday, didn't it? Yeah. Something happened up there. Hell, I knew it. You two were just looking for trouble, you know that? I suppose so. High Mountain Rangers. That's who you want to see. where I can find you. Aren't you one of the guys we talked to yesterday? Yeah. Well, where's your friend? He's long gone. He's probably home by now. I, uh, I just couldn't leave. I couldn't live with myself. What's this all about? It was an accident. I swear. But we were hunting. Calm down. Could you tell us everything you remember? We were hunting. Way up, I don't know where, a canyon or... I saw something move. And we had a few. I didn't even mean to shoot. I think I can make it. You have to. Does it really make any difference if I die? How can you say that? I haven't taken very good care of you. Cared? Done everything you could. I haven't been easy to live with. I've been a tough taskmaster sometimes. I haven't given you freedom that you want. No, no. I haven't given you the freedom you need. Whether that's true or not, it's cruel to say that I wouldn't mind if you died. I don't always say what I mean, son. Now that I've got the chance, I want to tell you. Yeah. 